I grew up in a household where we weren't sure where the next month's rent would come from. In that sense, I'll always have financial drive. But these days, that drive is becoming much less of a motivator. Now, my main motivation is to create a symbiotic relationship where my work enables me to uplift those around me, be that our customers, our employees, or our communities. Now, it's all about giving back, passing the torch to the next generation to create the same opportunities for social mobility that I've enjoyed. The smartest thing I did for my career is getting a well-rounded liberal arts education. It creates a much more holistic person. We've all heard about the 20-something college dropout who goes on to build a tech company and makes it to the Forbes billionaires list. While this blueprint works for a select few, the vast majority, myself included, benefit much more from a well-rounded education from a great institution like Anderson. Some people call it a safety net, but I view it much more as a trampoline. A safety net will catch you, whereas a strong foundational education from a place like Anderson will allow you to jump and reach for even greater heights. My guiding philosophy is to take audacious shots. It's okay to fail, but fail fast, and more importantly, learn from those failures. This is my biggest takeaway from navigating a business during a global pandemic. It was incredibly painful at the time, but it's a lesson that I'll treasure and keep for the rest of my life. People might be surprised to know that I still deal with a great deal of self-doubt, and I hope that I never lose that. That inner voice is my compass and my reality check. In my mind, I envision a Venn diagram where one circle is labeled complete narcissism and the other crippling self-doubt. That intersecting middle is what I like to call art, that sweet spot where you can truly make incredible magic happen. I hope that everyone who graduates from Anderson can find their unique superpower and build confidence in their domain, be that in business, the arts, or otherwise, and do so with integrity and resilience. I want to thank Anderson for this recognition as a Hall of Fame Young Alumni Honoree.